YouTube and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be about this wig right here. This wig I got from Hair Stop and Shop. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. I'll put it down below. It's called the... It's by Brown Sugar. It's a frontal lace human hair style mix lace front wig. So this isn't a lace part. This is a lace front wig. So this whole perimeter right here is all lace from ear to ear. And it's a comb in the back with adjustable straps. This is the box it comes in. I don't know if you guys can see that because my ring light is a little bright. But as you can see, this is how it looks on the models. And this is how it looks on me. I definitely had to finesse this wig because it was a mess, to say the least. I mean, it felt really nice. Like, this hair feels super duper soft. Like, it almost feels like real hair. But it's... Yeah, I had to finesse this because these highlights coming straight out the um the root like this was was horrible. So so this is the it says it's called not just a frontal it's a frontal unit. Um, it has a natural looking scalp, hand tied frontal lace, free part, thirteen by fourteen coverage. It says you can do updos and ponytail. I ain't gonna I'm not gonna do all that. I don't think that's you know a good idea. <laughs> So it's friendly on your edges, naturally comfortable, soft and manageable hair. And I got the color, I'm sorry, I got the color Honey Ash. So that's this color right here. The only customization that I did to this, I didn't pluck anything. I just literally parted the hair and then I added these darker roots because, like I said, these highlights coming straight out to the scalp was looking a little crazy. So I had to um, really finesse, you know this so I really just drew this on with my Kat Von D tattoo liner um, um so yeah that's what I did there to make it look natural um I really like this hair though it's really stupid long if you guys can see it's like all the way down to my waist this is a great like bundle dupe like these look like some expensive bundles and it's not this wig cost me 50 50 dollars i think um it was really hard to find so i might be wearing a wig one of your aunties wearing you know what i'm saying because it was sold out everywhere especially in this color so um i got it from here stop and shop and the shipping was actually really fast i ordered on thursday today is monday and it was here today so that was really fast and it was saying up to like seven days so I really wasn't expecting this wig so as soon as I seen it I'm like oh well I gotta film because this mug is here but I really like this wig it's super soft I'm gonna show you guys how I put on my wig um, how I cut off the lace and how I got this style right here so if you're interested in seeing this look then keep on watching make sure all right so I'm, oops, I'm gonna get started. This is the wig. Now, this shit really did scare me. Excuse me. This wig scared me because look at this, y'all. Like, this color is scary. But we gonna finesse this, though, because we, gonna, we ain't gonna be looking like this. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm not gonna pluck the part. I'm just going to, um, Put my concealer in my part, and um, this is wig is a lace frontal. So yeah, oh, what is that? Okay, I don't know. I don't know why that pattern is there, but whatever. I'm just going to take the wand of this and just paint it on a little bit. Um, but try not to like press through the lace. But I really want to match and this concealer is like the perfect color for me so I want it to match really well. So I'm using it. So, it should look like that. You guys see where I put it? 
that should be good enough for now. I might put some on the other side. But I always like it on the inside and on the outside. So it covers the knots both ways. So even it looks a little better now. If you can see it. Mm. Hey girl. Hey. Um, I'm recording. Yeah. Oh. I don't think I want that dress, that black dress, that lady dress, because I'm afraid that it's going to be cheap. What? Which one? Okay. All right, bye. Okay, so all I'm doing here is adding my black root. I'm using my Kat Von D um, liner, and I'm just adding the dark root in there. So that's all I was doing here. Okay, so I darken the roots, and the lace is actually really nice. It's soft. It's not hard or anything. So I'm going to slap this on. Oh, and I flat ironed my part a little bit. I flat ironed it down. Oh, ain't no combs in the front. I mean, it's not a big deal. Yeah, but if you like combs in the front, then it's no combs in the front. Frisbee synthetic is really nice. It does shed though. I don't know if you guys can see that. I mean, it's blonde, so I don't know if you guys can see, but um, it does shed. I don't know if it's because I just cut the lace or like it's just the initial like I'm out the box shed. But it is shedding right now, so just to let you guys know that this is shedding. But I really do like this wig. I think it's super cute. It looks natural. My hair is almost colored this color. But it's my hair is black and like underneath or whatever, so. Uh, if you guys have a big head, you probably won't be able to fit this wig because like I'm kind of cutting it a little close. So, um, yeah, I really like it. It's super long though. So it's gonna be taking some use to get used to. And I just like got this like, you know, waterway bohemian on the beach vibes or whatever. Got my little bohemian shirt on. So, you know, I'm just serving y'all all types of island vibes or whatever. <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Pull up with the spark, hit you in the dark. Cool to 